here we're examining a Quarcus agrifolia, California live oak, and we identified this dead snag on the side of the trunk here. But on closer inspection, we notice that there's a woodpecker nest under construction. It isn't completed yet. They've been drilling in a cavity here for a nesting site, and this is a lot of work for the bird to accomplish. So this is a fairly important nesting opportunity for one of our California native birds. It's more than halfway done, in my opinion. The diameter has already been achieved, and just additional depth is being developed. So in the case of this dead snag, we're actually going to keep it in favor of the bird habitat. The tree isn't suffering very much from having this dead snag on the side of the trunk, but the nesting site itself is very precious. These are oftentimes rare in urban settings where we don't have good nesting sites for all the birds. It stands on its own that the species requires certain site conditions to exist. They need certain qualities in the habitat for them to be able to even have a nesting site. So again, it's rare. This is probably the only nesting site for a woodpecker in 50 or 100 acres of woodland. This is rare enough that we could say it has a certain value and preciousness to the environment. So it's not a big deal for this tree to carry this snag. The woodpecker isn't normally attacking healthy wood. Normally what we find in our observations is that the woodpecker will go for a site where a dead limb or a dead snag is present on a tree, but the wood is already degraded, soft and pithy and easy for the woodpecker to cultivate their nest. So we don't find woodpecker nests often going into firm sound wood. They will target a site like this, an old dead snag. This limb has been dead for a long time because we can see the bark is falling off of it. The wood is dry and punk. You can actually, you can hear that it's, it's pretty soft and hollow sounding. So this is not firm sound wood. The woodpecker is not damaging the live vital part of the tree. It is going in on a soft, punk, pithy snag on the side of the tree. The woodpecker, besides being a native bird and a beautiful bird, and their wonderful call that they serenade the environment with, they do control certain pests and insects. They play a role in the checks and balances of the ecosystem. So in many cases, these interactions are far too complex for us to fully understand and to fully comprehend but we know they are part of this ecosystem and they're part of the balance of all the species. There's a lot of complexity that plays into this. You can find and see trees that are damaged by woodpeckers, trees that have been harmed by woodpeckers, even unto death. This is not such a case. This woodpecker is not killing this tree. It's simply taking advantage of site conditions to cultivate its nest. So the tree will live on with this snag without a problem. Therefore, we don't really have to remove it. I still find that the nest is more valuable present than not present. The intuition on this is the bird is valuable, the bird is precious to the ecosystem, and to make this small accommodation is no big deal. We're gonna leave this snag, and it's a conscious decision.